As many of you know, we had um, a study that was done on the South Dixie Corridor. It's called the ULI study. Well, this morning we're having coffee with the mayor here at Dan Ramones. Um, this, we do this periodically all around the city in little coffee shops and restaurants and invite people in the neighborhood or anybody to come and have an informal chat with me. Golf course and the clubhouse and that is a, both a, um, a community and, and an economic driver in this area, this small little area. What are the plans to bring that back? The mayor is dedicating some time and we're so grateful that they, she's coming to the south end. Um, we are a lot of little neighbors, a lot of uh, small businesses that are anxious for the Dixie Corridor to be revitalized. So we're, you know, I invited all of them to come and they're really happy to join and share some time with her. There is a committee that is in charge of um, presenting to the commissioners our petitions, our requests, our recommendations as to what we need. And it's made out of uh, a group of nine that they're neighbors, business owners, and also property owners. With a little bit of input from everybody, we have prepared a whole uh, list of recommendations for the commissioners to consider. In those uh, recommendations, we ask to um, see if they can, ha how we can improve, if we can do, need to have some branding for marketing for us, because it's really needed. There's a lot of small businesses that do not have the capacity or to hire somebody for branding or marketing. So this, we're asking the city to see if they can support us in that matter, and also to see if they can intercede with the DOT and see how they see the, uh, the whole corridor developing. There's some new, new developments going in. Um, we have the Villas of Antique Row that is about to open and uh, our new uh, Walgreens on Southern that's opening. The improvement in the South End has to be a partnership between those people who live down here, work down here, and own property down here, and the city. We've been discussing parking, we've been discussing landscaping, um, also, you know, safety for the pedestrians to cross, uh, bus stops, you know, try to see what's needed in the area, what type of shops are needed for the neighborhood. So it's quite a bit, and I think we have a lot of potential for, for to be developed in here.